What's up, Aries? Pretty Aura here, here to deliver your emergency room message. Um, this is about what needs to be addressed in your energy immediately. What cannot wait? Um, a lot of the times, um, our spiritual issues, they manifest as physical and mental issues. So I'm here to bridge that gap. Okay, during the course of this video, I will be um, giving recommendations about how to attack these issues head on, okay, to resolve them. Um, the prescription will be pinned in the comments. <clears throat> Um, also, you guys, you're watching this video. If you are Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, or Venus, I encourage you to watch the all videos um, in all of your placements. And you're watching this video also if you need answers about an Aries, okay? So, mentally, um, Aries, you know, it's like you guys are... Well, first of all, let's just say this. Um, there is... An energy of, you know, you guys feeling blocked, okay? And that would be in the in the spiritual side. And spirit is saying, listen, you're not blocked. All you need to do is make a decision, all right? F figure out where it is you want to go as far as believing and succeeding. Put that energy out into the universe and go with the flow, okay? So you have the support of spirit in the universe right now, okay? So in the mental energy you guys are seeming like you're giving and receiving and nurturing so basically this is like if you have a, maybe hanging out with your friends you could be giving comfort to a loved one to family um exchanging ideas talking to people especially during this pandemic it looks like you're the one aries sun moon arising um like you know hey how are you guys doing are you okay um, even though we're in, you know, quarantine, it looks like you're giving and receiving, um, advice even maybe. Okay. Um, <clears throat> let's check that out mentally, mentally for Aries. So you have observer and b between worlds. Okay. Um, I'm thinking that you guys are really being a support. Okay. This could have to do um, with a Gemini or a Libra. I feel like you guys are um, giving support maybe to a friend, um, exchanging ideas. Yeah. For some of you, it could be with your mom. Um, <clears throat> There's an energy of watching and learning or um, looking to understand something or someone, okay? Um, there, there's, there's, there's a lot of mental energy going on, okay? There's, there's something, there's, you know, I, I see other people's ideas. I see um, you thinking your own ideas, giving um, comfort to people, receiving and giving advice here. Surrender to your intuition. Tune into your inner voice. Be aware of gut feeling flashes or aha moments that come through to guide you. Yes, like I said, there's a lot of um, mental activity here, okay? Um, surrender to setting limits. It is healthy to set boundaries in your relationships. So this lets me know, practice expressing your needs and remember that no is a complete sentence. You may have someone, um, Aries, in your energy around you. Like I said, um, friends, this could even be with, with the Empress card here. This could even have to do with a mother figure um, of some sort where it's like um, they may be in your energy or they may be um, coming to you for advice or projecting their issues or whatever it is upon you, okay? So that's why we have the surrender to setting limits here. There's something that's maybe telling you, um, you know, it's time to hone in, uh, bring your energy back to yourself, 
okay? Um, this could be somebody um, mentally trying to look, yeah, because it's drama under here. So this could even be somebody mentally trying to pull you into some BS or mentally trying to manipulate you even maybe. Okay. Um, what I would do is I would get me a piece of selenite. I would give me a piece of selenite to keep the energy of peace around. I would also um, get some um, labradorite um, and amethyst and or amethyst. That's going to help filter your thoughts and that's going to protect you from any psychic attacks. Okay. Also, I would uh, I would get some lapis lazuli, okay? That way, when you go to um, setting limits or boundaries with this person, um, because we have surrendered the drama here, you will um, say it in a nice way, okay? Lapis lazuli um, works with your throat chakra, all right? Um, if, if your mind has been telling you something, um, there's something about dreams here as well. There's something about dreams here. Someone could literally, literally be trying to leech on your mental energy. <laughs> okay? You want to keep that amethyst on you. For some of you guys, if you close your eyes and you see eyes staring back at you, someone's trying to uh, pick your brain, okay? There could literally even be someone who's going to maybe even a reader about you, I'm hearing for some of you guys, in reference to you. Mm. Where's some black stones? Spiritually, um, it looks like... Uh, Spiritually, it looks like you guys were feeling a little blocked, okay, with the refusing to see here. Look at that, not for you. Like I said, you guys are feeling blocked spiritually. It's like, you know, you're, you, you may be, um, you may be going to, uh, go after your endeavors but you feel but you feel blocked i'm almost feeling like with the piece at the bottom of the deck i'm almost feeling like this is um i don't know if this may be an illusion okay or if literally someone is mentally um trying to block you or someone is trying to play on your mental And I'm going to say this right here with this Empress card, with this mother figure card, this could literally be a female. Okay. A female mother figure, uh, aunt friend. Okay. There's somebody trying to leech on someone's mental energy. Okay. They could be trying to sink themselves with your energy here i have to say it pay attention to your dreams i would recommend a dream journal for you guys pay attention to your dreams something else here spiritually You guys may be um, experiencing anxiety also. Oh, they, they, I really would recommend rec, um, recommend meditation. Meditation would definitely help you guys. This is going to bring you answers, okay? With this um, <clears throat> loyal heart in between worlds, you know, we have like doubles here. This could be, like I said, concerning a Gemini or a Libra, all right? But this could also be that <laughs> um, 
that somebody that you are loyal to is not for you. Okay? And if this is in the spiritual part, then um, I have to wonder, like, what, what what's going on here? How does that area? Yeah, there's something about not listening to your intuition and your thoughts not being clear, feeling blocked mentally. Look at that, okay? But for some reason, I'm still getting the green light, okay? So uh, as far as going after your passions and things like that, it's a, it's a yes. You're getting a green light, okay? I would get a piece of tiger's eye to, um, to continue to motivate me. But also the selenite and the amethyst is going to... Um, Keep your thoughts clear, okay? There's something that you're refusing to see. There's something that you're refusing to see or somebody who you're refusing to see that you're loyal to, but they're disloyal, okay? They're disloyal and they're not for you, okay? You can't see it. You can't see it. You're not accepting the 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 message, and so I would really get a piece of selenite, even angel light. Angel light even keeps you connected um, to the angels. All right, to receive this information. For some of you guys, someone's gonna get this in a dream. The color blue may be of significance to you guys. <clears throat> okay. Surrender your need to always be right. Give others the gift of letting them be right. Be yielding, not rigid. This will help resolve conflicts and improve your relationships. So this is what I was saying over here. Like, uh, you may need to get that lapis lazuli, okay? Um, with the surrender your need to always be right, I feel like there's something you're refusing to see and you're, and you're feeling like, no, this couldn't be, okay? But you have surrendered to your intuition. You know what's really going on, Aries. Mentally, you really know what's going on, but you are trying trying to not see it for what it is okay so as far as you know letting others be right um i really feel like this is a reference to uh you receiving those messages or from the spirit world or even um um your inner voice okay your inner voice At the bottom of the deck, you have surrender, low self-esteem. I said I feel something about um, something about being blocked. You deserve success, love, and abundance. Set an intention to identify and release any remnants of self-esteem. The tiger's eye and the carnelian is really going to help you, as I said. Um, you guys really... Um, you have the green light here to go for your passions, your dreams, your goals, and aspirations. So as soon as you clear your mental energy, you're going to be good, right? Especially since it could be being manipulated. So uh, surrender your low self-esteem, okay? Go after it, go after it. Because I can see there's a mental block, but there isn't a block. Look, physically, you have embraced and take the lead. So I don't know if you got, I, I'm feeling the energy of dancing. I'm feeling the energy of, somebody may have literally had a physical fight as well. Like, so what's up? What you want? What you, what you want to do? Kind of situation. <laughs> okay. Somebody may have had a physical fight. And if you didn't, it's probably coming. Um, but I see physically, it's like you guys are trying to go after your goals. There may be someone, um, even during this pandemic, who's actually working a lot. Who's, um, yeah, who's on, who's quick on their feet. Who's working a lot. Look at that. Milk and honey. Milk and honey. So someone's working, okay? <clears throat> With the milk and honey and surrender low self-esteem right with this sunflower milk and honey the sunflower you have this mother mother-like energy i'm feeling oshun um i don't know if you guys know uh, 
uh, anything about Oshun, but you guys who are, um, who resonate with that kind of energy, you may want to work with Oshun. She deals a lot with the solar plexus. Okay. That's why you, why I, um, said carnelian and, and, and tiger's eye, because, um, they help to give you self-esteem, um, as well as Oshun. So you guys may be getting to the money physically, right? Or, <clears throat> Or, like I said before, if you were feeling blocked, you are you have milk and honey here. So, go ahead and go after your dreams and your goals. Let's see um, what else. Somebody, there's a deep knowing. Someone really knows, okay? Someone knows uh, something about what's blocking them or they're not trying to pay attention to it or they're trying to resist some type of information about a person place or thing or about even themselves clarify what's going on physically please, clarify what's going on physically building blocks get to work get to work listen we have orphaned at the bottom of the deck this individual right here is a family member okay the giving and receiving i don't know if this person tried to take something from you or yeah this is it's mental energy trying to block you mentally i don't know some type of drama maybe um but this is a this is a a, a family type setting okay this is what I was saying, family, friends, whatever. Um, definitely with the orphan here, it's a family member for some of you, this person, okay? You need to set boundaries with this person. Surrender to setting limits. It's you. It's too much giving and receiving, okay? It's too much, you know, giving and receiving. This may be words, drama, arguments, or what have you, right? That That is maybe what you have a um inner knowing about uh that person okay and maybe a place that you're always running to this person running into them they could be coming up to you asking you things or trying to include you in certain drama okay but physically get you are working or getting to work and you have the green light from spirit when it comes to that despite all of you know uh the the mental uh conflict Surrender to non-action. Now is the time to be still and not act. Simply breathe and focus on your own power. Let others come to you. I think this has, um, <clears throat> with this non-action type situation, I really think this has to do with whoever's, uh, feel, whoever feels physical, whoever feels like they want to physically fight someone, okay? like this is the this is the energy of going up to someone like what's up what what <laughs> right but you know someone wants to literally it's like somebody wants to to hurt someone right so spirit, spirit is saying surrender to non-action but at the bottom of the deck you have surrendered to your soul's path your life journey has been perfectly designed for your soul's growth embrace every lesson in every moment and you also have embraced here so it seems like yeah you know you may have been um feeling blocked but you're getting the go ahead to go after your dreams goals and aspirations your soul's path okay right and and carnelian like i said will help you with that um Yes, Aries. Okay, that's what I have for you. Um, I hope that helped.